Hello everyone, today is Sunday, it is a new day, and as you saw, I um, cleaned a little bit, made the bed, now I'm going to fold some laundry while I watch some Gilmore Girls. Basically my whole day I've just been watching Gilmore Girls and like cleaning up a little bit, and then, I don't know, I think I'm going to get dressed a little bit, so like change my sweater, and then put my contacts in and stuff like that just get a little ready for the day and then I think I might head to the store and pick up some like plastic container drawers just because we have so much stuff that needs to go into a drawer and be organized but we just don't have any of those so they're like really cheap you know they're like the little plastic white bins type of thing so I think I'm gonna go get some of those and then I'm going to do a little fall home decor haul and decorate for fall a little bit. I just want to clean up everything before I decorate because I don't want to have to like clean up then decorate or like move things after I've decorated to clean, you know, so stuff like that. So yeah, I'm just going to do the laundry and I will fill you in on what happens next. Okay guys, so I just wanted to show you my outfit before I left. I will not even be gone that long, I just wanted to show you my outfit. So, I'm wearing this flannel, I actually don't know where it's from, it's Michael's, I love it. It's so like heavy and thick and warm, so I figured I'd wear it. And then this long sleeve shirt is from TJ Maxx, it's just literally a maroon long sleeve shirt. My joggers are also from TJ Maxx, but they are the Adidas brand. And I'm not wearing any shoes right now, but I will probably just put on a pair of sneakers. I will be back very shortly. I am just going to head to the store to get a few things just so I can like organize a little bit better in here just because we've lived here for so long and it's just, it's just, you know, not, <laughs> it's just not the best right now. So I figured let me get something to help with the situation. But anyways, I will see y'all soon. So we are in the portion of the vlog where I am showing you all of my fall decor, all the fall decor that I have recently gotten and also have already had. Oh wait, well, I forgot two things. One second. I've got my mug with coffee, my pumpkin, cute little pumpkin mug. All right, basically let's just get on started because I got quite a bit of stuff. Um, surprisingly, didn't spend that much money. I also had gift cards, so that really helps. Anyways, let's let's begin. So I kind of, I guess I'll just tell you where things are from as I grab them, just because it's easier. I'll try and make this super quick. All right, so I got this lovely pillow, super cute. Follow me to the pumpkin patch. Got this from Michaels. Everything at Michaels that is fall or Christmas is like 50% off. So if you have not gone holiday seasonal shopping yet do it at michael's because everything is so cute at michael's by the way last year i got this pillow at michael's don't remember how much it was um i think that pillow was only 15 this one probably around 10 or something got it last year like i said this is one i've already had so done with the pillows all right let's continue with the things that i've already had just so i can get those out of the way first thing this candle smells really good from bath and body works Love it, amazing, can't wait to light it. Another candle that I got from TJ Maxx last year, this one was, the price is on here, $8, love it. It smells really fresh. Another candle that is from White Barn, this is Harvest Gathering. Ugh, amazing, love it. Haven't burned this one yet, I will though. But it's a cute like fall aesthetic with like the black top and then the green, you know, packaging glass, you know, anyways. And this one is more, I think, of like a Christmas candle than a fall candle, but I honestly burn this all year round. It smells the best. If you can get your hands on this, 1000% you should. It's from Bath & Body Works. It's called Campsite Coffee. It smells amazing. 
I need to buy another one when this one runs out. I'm not that far along, but soon I will be, especially this season. So this candle and then this little container that this is in, this is a candle holder pumpkin type thing. This is from the dollar store. I don't know if they still have these, but I got this last year. Amazing. Try it out. Last year I got this cute little sign from Michael says, hello pumpkin. I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet, but I will figure it out. These lights I got from Kmart. My dog is snoring. I'm very sorry if you can hear any of that. Anyways, these twinkly lights are green lights. They're meant for Christmas, um, but I figure since they were green, I can do like a cool little like thing for them, especially like Halloween, you know, orange, green, like black, all that type of stuff. Um, kind of goes well together, so I figured I could use those. This cute little candle, also from the dollar store. I don't know, like what, it just says leaves crisp flannels, leaves crisp flannel friends, bountiful blessings, thanks. I have a lot of candles. Didn't realize I had so many. And then this is another one from White Barn. It's like one of the little mini ones, and it's just the scent autumn. It smells nice i don't know pretty sure this is from tj maxx it just says if the room fits fly it cute little sign uh great for halloween i'm not big on halloween decorations it's more fall decorations because i can stay up longer um but i do like to have a few halloween ones here and there and then put them up in october just so you know kind of fits the theme of what is going on this sign also pretty sure is from tj maxx Happy fall, y'all. Super cute. Fits my aesthetic. Love it. All right. Well, earlier today, I went to Big Lots and I got a storage container thingy. Really small one. I don't need to show you it. It has nothing to do with what I have going on here. So, got this candle. It's called uh, Snuggly Sweater. Smells really good. Has pumpkins on it. Really cute. It was only $6, so I picked it up and yeah. Got this cute little pumpkin from Michaels. I think it's a craft pumpkin because it was on sale with the craft stuff. Yes, it's called a craft pumpkin pumpkin on top on the tag. Originally it's 20, but I got it for 10 because everything is 50% off for the Halloween stuff. And I think even some stuff was 60% off. So do it now, ladies. Let me tell you. Got this cute little skull. So this is going to be one of my Halloween decorations because you know it's a little black skull. Um, this was from Michael's super cute. I think this was only two dollars Great find at Michael's. This is actually like a baking dish I don't know what you would bake in here honestly because uh, I don't know like it's just a cute little jar So I figured maybe I could put something in the top of it or nothing at all. Who knows? Also got a few things at Hobby Lobby So I got these cute little decorative pumpkins that I'm gonna put in something uh, everything at Hobby Lobby that was for fall stuff was all like 40% off. So I think I got these for around like eight-ish, six-ish dollars or something like that. I don't know. Super cute. Also got these super cute orange pumpkins. I felt like I needed a little bit more orangey fall stuff just to mix in there. Got some thumbtacks. I also got this little pail because I just got two succulents that I'm going to put in here. Um, I just need to get more soil because there's not enough soil in what they have, what they're in right now. So I kind of can't put them in here yet. Also got this cute little orange pumpkin. It's a little bit heavier than the other ones. It's more of like, not like a paperweight, but kind of like a, you know, stick on there type of thing. So got one of these. And now that I'm thinking about it, I didn't get any like medium sized pumpkins, but that's fine. I don't really need them. And from the Christmas tree shop, I ended up getting these two pumpkins, white pumpkins. They are were only a dollar, so I figured why not? And my friend actually bought them for me. She was like, they're two dollars, I'll get them for you. And I was like, okay, so yep, got these two little white pumpkins from Christmas tree shop. And then I only got two things at TJ Maxx, which is the surprising for me considering I am obsessed, but honestly, their selection was just not good this time. Like they, everything was just picked over and there wasn't a lot of stuff. First thing that's not really all related, that's going to be like in the house all year round is this little like little um, coat hanging sign just says welcome on it. Um, I wanted one that was going to be able to be hung on the wall that we could hang our keys on, my bag, and also the dog's leash. So yeah, it was only $13, so that was a find. And the final thing that I got in general and also from TJ Maxx is this cute little sign that says hello fall with the pumpkins and the truck. 
So kind of like the sign that I already have, but a little bit different. Super cute. I know I will use this for like multiple years to come because it's really nice quality and it's just, it's, it's super cute. And I was, I was excited when I saw this and I was like, there's no way that I'm not getting it. And it was only $10. So I think I made out like a bandit. All right. Well, that is it for the haul portion of this video. And now we're going to decorate. I'm going to put on Hocus Pocus and decorate for fall because now I'm super excited and yeah. Okay, so I have decided that I think I'm just gonna be a little bit annoying and not watch Hocus Pocus while I decorate and talk to you guys while I do it because I'm so indecisive and I never know what to do. Okay, so I have all my things laid out right here. I still don't know where everything's gonna go. I mean, clearly I'm gonna switch out this pillow with this pillow and, you know, put the fall one back up. And then all of the decor stuff, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do with it yet. And that's why I have you, so that I can figure it out along the way. Let's do this little pumpkin candle. Actually, I think that would be cute near everything. And then the school here looks cute. Hmm. Oh. Wait, I know what I want. I have these lanterns from my wedding that I didn't get to have yet. So I was thinking actually that I would decorate or use one and put some pumpkins in it. So that's what I'm gonna do actually. I'm gonna put some pumpkins in it. So I'll stick some of these in here around. Stick this in here on top along with the little acorn. Oh, that's cute. I don't know. It looks a little underwhelming. Okay, let's see. That you would look a little cute if I unwrap them, you know. Maybe put the pumpkins in there. Oh, I wonder if the pumpkin candle would fit in there. Let's try that first. Nope, that was dumb. kind of cute especially from the side looks kind of cute with one of the bigger holes all right so now i just need to actually fix it and make it look nice that looks pretty dang cute if i don't say so myself so now the question is where do i put it so as you can see i found a great spot for my lantern look at that look how cute that is so cute so i put this little white pumpkin from hobby lobby there and then the cute little lantern and then this candle which i can still light since it is out and then it's right next to my dog's area so i also found a good spot for my little fall sign and then my little pumpkins i do not have any like holiday or pumpkin themed flowers that can go in here. So I'm just gonna keep my red and white roses that are fake in there. Just think it looks good, so it's fine. My all you need is fall candle can go here and my coffee one. So in here, I'm pretty sure I'm going to put these pumpkins in there. I'm gonna put them in there and see what it looks like. Or like styrofoam, basically. So I'm just gonna like styrofoam. That's what it looks like. So I'm not exactly sure where this would go. I don't have enough places to put things in my apartment. Well, I will check back in with you guys once I have some things figured out. All right, guys, I have everything set to show you. So let's start by my door. I have this cute little Hello Pumpkin sign where a uh, different sign used to be hanging. And as we walk into the living room, you will see the cutest little setup, which is what something you've already seen, the lantern, the candle, and the pumpkin, and then the other stuff I just kind of put in there. All right, so down here is that little pumpkin that I got, and I decided to just put it there because it would look really cute. Um, it'd be in the way over here, so I put it there, and then you look up, and there's my little sign that says, Hello Fall, super cute. Okay, and then down here by the TV, hard to see, but we have the little skull and the harvest gathering candle. Over here, we do have a candle burning, my new candle, um, a little pumpkin, and then the orange pumpkin candle holder in the back. This candle actually was down here, but for the time being, since I'm burning it, I'm just putting it up here and then moving it back down there when I'm done. So up here, starting with the shelving unit, we have the, if the broom, oh, focus, focus, there we go. If the broom fits, fly it. So that, so that one's kind of like a Halloween decoration. We have a cute little pumpkin right there. You know, the cute little happy fall y'all sign. Um, here is another fall candle. 
this I just put here because I didn't know what to do with it. Um, I didn't like buy too much. I just don't have enough space to put everything. So this, I just don't know where it's gonna go yet, but it's just filled with the pumpkins and stuff. Here is another little pumpkin. And then down here, I just put that love you always sign, which was up where the broom one is. And then there's my campsite coffee. And down here are the two little pumpkins that were a part of the other stuff. And over here on my dining room table, that is a mess, is my farmer's market candle and then the little thing. And I changed it out because less are in there now. And then over here on the couch, I still need to move the other pillow, are both of my fall pillows. Super cute, love them. That is all of my fall decorating. I do not think I will buy any more fall decorations. The only thing fall that I will probably buy will end up going out on my little porch. Yeah, that is it. All right, so honestly guys, I think that is going to be it for this vlog. So I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed decorating with me because I know I love decorating for fall and seasonal times of the year. It's very fun. Um, but don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias as well as subscribing to my channel. I will see you guys next time. Bye.